welcome to Vintage Coin Op Restorations and our latest project. Here we have Bally's 1950 spaceship. What you're looking at here is probably the nicest original that is known. Uh, it still has all its original graphics that have not been painted or touched up. This is all in original condition. rocket itself is it all also in original condition. No, we did do a little cleanup on it. Well, I should say more, more than a little cleanup. Uh, we deoxidized all the paint. Um, any of the flaking paint we had to remove uh, and uh, secure all the, the rest of the paint with a clear coat. Otherwise, this thing would uh, even be losing more paint. But uh, at this point, it is in really just an absolute beautiful condition. All the plastic and metal has been taken off, polished by hand, but not on a machine. Because something like this, if you watch our other videos and the other rockets that we've done, um, all these parts are basically uh, chrome plated. But this one shows its originality. all its lenses which is extremely rare um, majority of these things have all been snapped off broken but uh, this one has all of them intact now the kid would get on get onto the ride on this side as you can see he's got a little couple steps jumps inside this jump seat here Got a lever here that uh, has a push button on the top, and that button, what that does is controls a um, a, uh, a coil, a recoil inside there. As you push down on it, you hear a tick, 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 similar to like a, a pinball knocker that's supposed to simulate like a laser gun of some sort. And on the dashboard here, you have a um, press to blast off, and what that does is actually uh, flashes the lights up here in the front. And of course, where that little bit of tinsel is, uh, when you jump in here and this ride starts to go, the fan is blowing right at your face, so you feel like you're flying. And our dashboard also flashes up at all these little spots in sequential order of you know flashing lights. box. It's all original. Except for the coin box holder there. Completely rebuilt. And we'll take a sneak peek of what's going on inside this bad boy here. Inside this machine here you have an original motor and all its workings. Though we did take it completely apart, every single part came apart and uh, pretty much had to uh, remove the rust and change bearings and uh, any, everything because when the ride, uh, when we got it, it was just completely locked up. And that's just from years of rust on the axles and things that just, you know, prevented the machine from running freely. Here's your fuse box. Come around the other side. What a time warp piece. This could have been in front of any store in the 50s. In fact, 
every any store would love to have something like this because they know the kids at that time with all the TV shows going on at that time that were space related uh, they would have loved to get into this machine well enough talking about it let's uh, light it up so put my 10 cents in Close the door all the way. The original timer on the machine is set for basically one minute, uh, and it's a primitive timer. Literally, is a pin with three screws sticking out of it. And as it rotates, it flips the on and off switch actually manually on and off. Pretty cool. I'll show you the lever here. You can pull back on it. You pull back the speed control. You can see the rocket going faster. And now it just slows down when you bring it back up. Hard to see all the lights flashing. Well, there you have it. Bally Spaceship. If you're in the market for a rocket ship key ride, if you have one for sale or you need one restored, please give us a call. We're located in Chicago, Illinois. Our phone number is area code 630-624-7466. Thanks for watching and make sure to subscribe to my channel so you can see all the new machines coming to the warehouse. Thanks for watching.